millions of Americans look to the stars and have followed NASA's space program from the man on the moon in the 1960s. <laughs> Armstrong is on the moon. Neil Armstrong. To the shuttle program for the next 30 years. Followed by the private sector's unmanned reusable rockets of today, 2018. Welcome home, Columbia. Beautiful, beautiful. Your goal for APU shutdown. Blue ship is very heavy, Reed. Well, there's definitely an e-ticket. After uh, serving the world for over 30 years, the space shuttle turned its place in history. During shuttle launches, NASA needed an armored personnel carrier to protect its pre-flight astronauts in case of an emergency during launch procedures. Shoulders of the space shuttle, America will continue the dream. The KSC M113A2 was a perfect armored personnel carrier for the unique requirements NASA had at the time. A fully armored, tracked amphibious tank developed in 1960. Powered by a Detroit six-cylinder diesel engine with an Allison transmission, it delivers 275 horsepower. Top speeds of 42 miles per hour on land and 4 miles per hour on water. Approximately 16 feet long and 9 feet wide. Open inside with bench-style seating. It holds 11 passengers and 2 crew members. The driver's seat was designed for a spacesuit. The controls have two hand levers and one pedal. Its gauges are open and easy to read. NASA utilized three M113 tanks during launches. A safety fire team was positioned inside one of the M113 tanks close to the base of the launch pad. Zip lines were to be used by the astronauts to get off of the launch pad as safe and fast as possible. Once on the ground, the plan was for the astronaut flight team to drive the two empty M113s that were waiting alongside the fire rescue team. Each astronaut trained to drive the M113 tank before launch day. The emergency procedures and the driving briefing were one of the last things done before the launch. Number three specifically was used as a workhorse for the NASA training process. There is a very good chance every astronaut trained and rode in this very vehicle. It is an exciting plan, worthy of a Hollywood James Bond movie. Astronauts, zip lines, and tanks. The M113 tank was utilized to keep the space program safer. Fortunately, the plan was never utilized. But the M113 tank still remains a piece of U.S. space history.